Hi, I'm Kep Kepner, CPA here in Dallas. We're talking about techniques to help you be a better salesman. We've talked about getting your clients to quali be qualified by you instead of you selling to them. And we've talked a little bit about how you identify the need in a client. Now let me tell you the killer question from most prospects is, what's it going to cost? Well, that's a killer question because you really may not have gotten to the real need and so the cost doesn't have any meaning in light of what you're going to do for the client. The client says, what's it going to cost? You say it's going to cost you $30,000. Well, if you haven't gotten to the need, then it's all on you and he has in mind something else, then you're not going to get another shot. He figures you're too expensive. Or maybe you're not expensive enough. It depends. So here's a magic question you can use. You can say, what is your budget for solving this problem? Now what you've done is you've taken this question, what does it cost, and you've taken this big rock and you've thrown it back in their lap. Because if they don't have a budget, how are they going to provide money to pay you for what you do. If they don't have a budget, then they're putting it all on you and not on them. So you have to find out what they're, what they're willing to spend rather than what it's going to cost you to do it. Because like many of you, we can provide services from $150 to $100,000. So when somebody says, what's it going to cost, wow, I could give any number and I'm probably going to be wrong. So instead, I say, what's your budget for solving this problem? That's a great technique to put this cost question back in the hands of the person that's going to spend the money. Then, if they say, well, it's going to cost us $400 and my budget is $400 a month and what you've got is going to cost $500 a month, then you can start talking about the differences. Well, for $400 a month you can get this, but for $500 you can get this. So it's important to take this cost question and put it back where it belongs. Not on you, it belongs on your prospect, regardless of what you're selling. And when you do that, Again, you're making the prospect be qualified by you, not you trying to sell them. That builds a much stronger relationship at the start. So regardless of who you're selling to, you need to sell effectively to build your business, and we can help. Give us a call.